Hey Motive Nation, Nick Parr here with you in Grand Rapids, Michigan at Spectrum Lanes introducing the new Primal Shock. Really excited about this release. We've taken two of our best balls and combined them into one with the Primal Rage Core, the Impulse V2, um, and then wrapped it around the Turmoil MFS cover stock from the Venom Shock. It comes out of, the, out of the box with the exact same finish as the Shock, uses a stronger and just a little bit more angular core compared to the gear core found in the actual Venom Shock. So this ball is going to be really good when there's actually a little bit more oil and almost too much oil for maybe a Venom shock. Um, Venom's probably just a little bit too smooth down lane. It's, it's forcing you too close to the friction. The Primal shock is actually going to allow you to get in the oil and shape it with not needing as much friction down lane. So the first Primal shock you're going to see me throw is just my normal tester layout, um, 55 by 5.5 by 35. This one is really good at picking up in the mid lane for me. Since it's pin up, it's going to flare a little bit more. So I'm definitely going to have that traction in the oil, which is what I want out of this ball. And the second one you're going to see me throw is uh, my pin down layout that I love, especially on these bigger diff cores. This is 45 by 5 and 3 quarters by 65. Um, I say that I like doing pin down on these just to get it to flare less in the front, which allows it to store a little bit more energy for down lane motion. The Venom Shock allowed me to throw it into the friction a little bit more because it needed more friction compared to the Primal Shock. So you'll see it's a little bit further right down lane because I needed it to get to that friction. The Forge Ember allowed me to stay in the oil a little bit more and play more of a trapped angle to where I didn't need to see the friction as much as the Primal, but you'll see that it is much smoother down lane because of that. That's fine. The Iron Forge allowed me to stay nearly in the same spot as I did with the Primal Shock, but you'll definitely see that it gets further down lane and is much more angular off the spot down lane. <laughs> 